over 614. Well, I'm having some lunch. Let me turn off this TV. I'm just muted. I hope that I'm able to maintain this food because I'm going to go out to the Isuzu in a minute and pull the blower motor out of the air conditioning system. I turned it on the other day and it made a god awful noise. So we're going to take the blower motor out and see what's in there. So I figure I'll let you hear this. Whew, it's some things in this car too. Yeah, let me turn the key on. Alright. And listen. It's gonna work today? Oh, here we go. Something's wrong. Something's bad wrong. We'll turn the key back off. But uh, we're going to have to take this blower motor out. Wish it would stay closed, but it doesn't. The entire lock is gone. If it's in here, nope. Oh well. I'm going to put on some gloves. Because I feel like it's probably going to be pretty nasty. Let's see here. Let's see if I can rotate this camera so you can see what I'm doing. Maybe that'll work. It appears that there's only screws holding this in. Find the screw again. Can't feel that so well. There's one. in it stuck or something probably had some rubber uh, when we turn it the more difficult it is to turn it is it broke loose well, pretty tricky That screws out. And there's one over here in the corner. Maybe I can get to it. I can't feel very well with these gloves. There it is. Well, stop. go I'm in trouble orienting myself come on get in there there it is. There we go. It's a little bit tight. I sure don't look forward to seeing what's going to come out of here. There's that screw. Where's the last one? 
back here. It's just as difficult as the other two. Here we go. We're getting in. bit difficult I'm telling you the uh, rubber in here is when he got it stuck but we're, we're on the way there's usually only three screws holding these floor motors in nearly every car ever made so this should get it Being stubborn now. Oh, I can't wait to see what's in here. These are four screws. One, two, and three. I'll have it all the way out. loose such a pain in the rear Unbelievable. Why has it got to be so difficult? Almost out. It's stuck. I think I might have to put something in there to brown it a little bit. These high bars have really been worth the money. Why does it have to be so stinking difficult? Seems like everything in my world is difficult in some kind of weird way. And that one is stripped. It's not coming out. So I'm going to have to put some Mama Jamma on it. There we go. 
unbelievable that it stuck. Let me go get the power tool. And the screw hole again. Hmm. Not nice. It's stuck. Stripped out. Just great. Everything's always difficult, isn't it? Broke it loose. Let's see what's in here. Oh, nothing but a dirt dauber. That's nice. That's better than a mouse or something. Yeah. Lots better. And that's what was giving me the problem. That right there. It's got a stinking nut on it. Well, I can just stick it back together now. We'll spin it though. We'll see what happens. We'll stick it back in. And I'll get back with you in a second. I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm going to have to get this out of here. I won't be able to put it back together, I don't think. Well, let's try it. Let's try to put it back together. Yeah, maybe it will. Back up in the hole. so difficult <laughs> let me get something get this out of here it's it's fighting me get to the bottom of the stink that's in this car Smells worse than bar carpet. Right, that's out of there. I'm having such a hard time getting the manipulating these screws for some reason. Can't seem to get I can't seem seem to get myself oriented.
never tighten it, turning it backwards. Jesus. Right, that one's in. Good grief. help out I'm getting this thing ready to sell all right that's it you guys have a great day appreciate you watching the video let me put my tools up hey guys Woo. I burned up doing that but uh it's success with the exception of that one screw but that's the way it is uh, sometimes these old cars the plastic will break. It's all brittle and you just have to deal with it. But I'm always happy to show you things. If you enjoyed my video, even if you didn't, please subscribe. It means a whole lot to me. And hey, click on that little bell and you'll get notified when I make the next video and post it. So once again, thanks for watching. Have a great day.